So a week before I left Lagos, all I had in all my accounts was 6,000 naira. And I remember talking to myself, 6,000, 30 states. So we were even supposed to do a split of 30 states to 6K. <laughs> How much is one state supposed to cost? And I remember giggling at myself and saying, God, I look to you on this. The first state that opened up to us was Kaduna. Finding out the cost to transport myself to Kaduna was around 9,000 plus. And I had 6K. I remember calling the pastor of the church I was going to minister, asking him to help me because I had just 6,000 and I needed help with 3,000 plus to come into town. He said to me clearly, we don't raise money for traveling evangelists. <laughs> I remember smiling. I'm like, okay, sir, am I still ministering on Sunday service? He said, yes. Am I still ministering in the evening? He said, yes. I said, I'm coming, sir. I remember softly the Holy Spirit began to let me know that it wasn't my take to blame anyone because they didn't send me. So I focused on the one who spoke to me. And then I told the pastor I was coming. That same week, the Sunday before the week I left, that's like, okay, two Sundays before the week I left, I had a program in Lagos called Bible Study for the Creatives. And at the meeting, one of my friends I invited spoke to me about getting an international passport. I remember telling her that I don't need an international passport. I'm going to 30 states. I don't need a passport to enter bus. She laughed, but still said, I think you need a passport. So I said, okay. If you say so, but I don't have the cash, I just have 6K for my trip. And she said, it's not about money first. I'm like, oh, it's all right. So she told me that she was going to get me the contact of an immigration officer. And then let's see how it goes. I'm like, it's all right. I started planning to get my international passport a week before I left Lagos. She sent me a contact and then spoke to the person on my behalf, sent me part of the money for the passport. And I'm like, okay, it's all right. It was, she sent like 10,000 out of like a 35k. And then that week I spoke to one or two persons and then the funds for the international passport came. To my surprise, I wasn't even expecting that money because I was expecting more money for my trip rather than for a passport. I remember when I called the passport officer telling him my name. I said, my name is Yemi Levite, sir. I want to come and do my international passport. And he said, um, Yemi Levite, that name sounds familiar. I said, uh, maybe you've heard one of my songs. He said, which of your songs? I sang it on the phone and suddenly I heard him say, Oh, my pastor sings your song. You've been a blessing. Wow, it's a pleasure, sir. I was shocked on my own side. I'm like, God, oh, okay. And then I remember getting to Akure for the international passport processing. I got there the day I got there was the day I captured, was the day I was given the passport. It was express. God had gone ahead of me. You know, beyond my imagination, I wasn't expecting that. And after the international passport conversation, the immigration officer wasn't even on seat, but I was attended to with favor. He spoke to me and said, maybe one of these times you can come around. I said, I do parlor worship. I don't mind coming to your house to do worship. He's like, parlor worship, what's that? And I remember that also inspired him to invite me over to come lead the immigration officers in worship during the tour. I returned back to Lagos. Um, that same day when I got the passport and I had a ministration invitation and then Naturally, I don't charge. I don't give an amount when I'm invited. I finished ministering and then I was given an envelope And what was inside was 40,000 when I saw the money. I'm like 40,000 Thank you, Jesus <laughs> The next morning I had another session somewhere and then I was given another envelope, it was 20,000. So that makes all 60,000. That's like times 10 of what I had before. I was like, wow, God, you're so amazing. Is this how you work? Okay, so Cardinal, let's go.